this one's the the next two bosses are definitely a lot well especially the fourth boss but this one's definitely a step up from the per, the previous two it's still not amazing but you have to think more basically how this turn goes is that you have tiny here new character actually um I don't know how I didn't die just then, but hey, the game was nice. Okay, I died there. That was me being overzealous. But, um... Yeah, you have new character Tiny over here. Hi. No real introdu introduction. You're just kind of here. <laughs> but, um, yeah, you just jump on, jumping on these platforms. He tries chasing you. When some of them, uh, start go, uh start to turn red that's when you want to try jumping on them and then quickly jumping off of them so when they fall tiny's gonna fall and then he loses health and that's pretty much how this fight goes you, you aren't really fighting him head on but it's an interesting uh perspective not perspective but an interesting take on a boss i guess and you you can You have to definitely think more than the other bosses so far. So, I approve. It's a lot more fun as well. Because th the thing with um, the last two bosses is that it's it's a lot of waiting um, for you to be able to hit them, and that's not really fun. And you're done. All right. Let me try see if I can do this. Ah, I didn't do it. <laughs> Basically, what you can do, if you time it right, you can jump to where uh, Tiny is on the last hit. And when you're doing the victory animation, he's just. Crash is just flying, like floating on air. It's pretty great. And there are no uh, com uh, conversations. So, yeah. Alright. Hanging out. Okay, so this is another sewer, le sewer level. I think this is the last one, actually, but don't quote me on that. We'll see. But I'm pretty sure it is, because we've seen, like, a good amount but so far. Like, two, I think. Two or three. Do, 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 do. Alright. And there is another secret here as well, so... Actually, no, that's gonna annoy me. Get it? Alright. I don't even have a mask, do I? No, I do! Alright. Okay, don't even try. I don't even know why I'm bothering getting the boxes. Don't even care. Alright. Okay. So the secret is back in, in this room. You just go backwards. But since we're going through the level already, we may as well just... Fin uh, finish it normally first or maybe let's see see if we can get the uh Chris the box gem and then going back we'll see like see how far see how far we have to go but we're probably gonna have to play the level twice I'll go Woo! Ugh. 
Nice. Okay, I was trying to avoid it, but in the process, I just killed myself. Cool. <laughs> At least we're just here. Alright, so this is... Here. So maybe we're close. Who know? Who knows? Is this it? Oh, okay. So we can actually go and get the secret now. Cool. Kill me. Alright. And now we can go back. And here's the secret. It doesn't change the music, which is a little bit weird, but... Rest assured, rest assured you're going the right way. You see all this lava here as well. Oh gosh, okay. Slow down. Now we have to totally fly, which the name makes no sense, but yeah. Well, the only th the only way I can see it making sense is the the bug lights here flying, but you yourself aren't, so I don't really get that. <laughs> but yeah, this is um another dark level, but this time though. It's more akin to the uh, dark levels from Crash 1, where you had Aku Aku, but this time, instead of having him be the light, you have this bug light here, which is so much better than having Aku Aku, because you don't have to worry about taking a hit. Well, actually, well, you do, because otherwise you'll die, obviously, obviously but you don't have to worry about losing light if you get hit, I mean. But you have to worry, still have to worry about dying, so that's still nothing new. But that that's to be expected, really. Do 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 do. All right. I don't think there's any, uh, what's it, skull, skull pathway to, uh, there's one in, if there isn't, there's one in the, another dark level that's at the end of the game, but. That's not going to be for a little bit. Ah, oh, screw it. Screw it, just go, just go. Oh, come on, why could I, why can I fall there? Yeah, that's a problem with uh, this game sometimes. Like, you can go towards the Z axis or the Z axis, because I'm British, huh? <laughs> but uh, yeah, you can go to the Z, uh, Z axis, and um, sometimes you can actually interact with it. Like, yeah, I can ju I can jump out of it, which sometimes it can cause some uh, annoying deaths. Other times you can use it to your advantage, and. That's something that you can do a lot of in the two levels in the final warp room, which is actually a lot, a lot of fun to do. Alright, oh come on, really? I feel like I can just jump over, actually. Let's try that, because that's going to save a lot of time. Alright, oh gosh. I guess that. Yo! Okay. I can just do that. Yay, I outran the bug. Cool. Okay. 
Ugh. Too late. That is pretty cool, though. Doing that. Alright, with this... There are a bunch of... Crates you have to break by doing the belly flop. Now, it's all dark around here, but what you want to do... Alright. So basically, when what you want to do is just keep going ahead, belly flop everywhere, <laughs> pretty much. And break as many of them as you can with, before you can uh, get the bug. And as soon as you get like a cluster of Wumper Fruit, that's when you know you're you're going too far. And then you just go back. Because if you go any further, you're just going to fall. You're just probably going to fall or something. So, yeah, and then get the bug. And we got all of them. Nice. But yeah, you basically want to do that. Okay. <laughs> that was close. You want to do that though because the uh, the bug doesn't give you enough time to get all the boxes or get all the yeah get all the boxes before it disappears. So oh dear. All right. Okay, well, I think that's enough for one session. I've been recording for how... Yeah, I've been recording for two hours, so... I think we're... It's, uh, it'll be a good time to stop. So, I'm gonna... Yeah, I'm just gonna put my safe out here. Don't know why it's not letting me put my own name in, but whatever. Either way, though... That's going to be it for this session of Crash 2. Hope you guys are enjoying the playthrough so far. And I'll see you guys next time for the rest of Warp Room 4. And the rest of the game in general. So, yeah. I'll see you guys then. Peace!